Hello YouTube, hello fellow questers. This is Artem from Germany featuring Marvel Puzzle Quest and today's video is featuring a Crash of the Titans fight. As you can see the character you need in order to get the legendary token is Forza Miles Morales Spider-Man uh, Spider-Man <laughs> Spider-Man <laughs> Spider and you are fighting four star ah, come on four star spider woman all right unfortunately my Miles Morales has only five or six covers five oh seven seven covers I might be able to defeat spider woman but I don't think it will be on my first attempt so this video might be a little bit longer bear with me I'm gonna take some boosts I'll start with purple and blue as well as red unfortunately I don't have any purple covers for this uh, Miles Morales otherwise I could use his ability and I will go with an all damage boost. Yeah. All right. So, in order to defeat Spider Woman, I have to go invisible. And for that, I need purple AP. Uh, da, 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 da. She has. We share all colors except she has black, and I have. Uh, I have yellow. All right. So black, red, and purple. This I have to deny. Mm -hmm. Let's start like this. Nice. That's not good. <laughs> so guys, what about what uh, what about your thoughts on Lockjaw and are you back since the uh, since yesterday's uh, shutdown of the game? Um, let's go like this. Oh, come on. How much does she need? 14 and 8. All right. Do, 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 do. Cool. Okay. <clears throat> now I have to go invisible. I am invisible. Nice. I can stun her. No. Well, this is unfortunate. Uh, hopefully, she doesn't. Uh, she does. Fuck. Is that gonna kill me? No. <sighs> if she has 14 reds, I am dead. Am I? Well, either way. This matchup is so unfortunate. Oh. This one I have to destroy, right? Hmm. 
I hate that ability. She matched my invisible invisible invisibility tile away. I couldn't do anything. Let's try it again. Wife him. All right. Yeah, I will take this. Hmm. Okay. No, it's not good. Neither is this. Yeah, that's the problem you face when you don't have enough covers for a champion, uh, a character. Hopefully this time I can turn invisible and she will not match my invisibility tile away. There you go. This seems to be better. I can stun her. Um. This is going to be a long fight. <laughs> oh shit. No. <sighs> Please don't match that purple way. Ah, oh, come on. So sad. I just need one good invisibility tile on the board that she cannot match away. And then I will defeat her through red attacks, my red ability and matchups. Otherwise this is this is just impossible without a fully covered one or at least a decently covered one. Oh, am I dead? No, I live. <laughs> I 
I had a similar case when I played Howard the Duck against Four Star the Punisher. And my Howard is only covered with four or five covers. And that Punisher is almost max covered. So in order to destroy him, I had to go invisible as well. And it was a long fight. I think after the third attempt, I defeated him. Hopefully I can defeat Spider-Woman on this second try. So far it is looking good. I just have to collect enough purple AP in order to go to turn invisible whenever she matches my invisibility tile away. If I can do that it should be a guaranteed win. No, this is not enough to destroy her. I have to poke her down. And the black tile has to go away. Otherwise she will just tank the damage. It's gone. How many tiles do I have? All right. And go invisible again. I nearly forgot, just remembered that the purple ability changes when you are invisible. That's really good. If I collect enough purple, I can destroy her, hopefully. One more match. Oh shit. See, this is what I don't like. Invisible again. Sorry if I'm not talking a lot today. A little a little bit grumpy, but nevertheless I wanted to make a video and address after this fight some issues I have encountered with the game so far and you might even think the same about those issues. All right. Uh, match this away. Almost done. I think that's it. Is it enough to kill her? No, but the next matchup will be. Alright. Yay! See, I got it on the second attempt. Good. Thanks for bearing and staying with me community all right I already acquired full points so there will be no daily rewards except the legendary token all right let's open let's pull it maybe a yellow Miles Morales cover At least no five star Matt Murdock. Okay, Jean Grey. I don't have this ability. Yep. 
Yes. Great. I'm satisfied with that. Now to the issues I have encountered so far. I'm not going to discuss the incident yesterday where the game was shut down due to some error. I mean, this has to, this has to be expected that games sometimes shut down because some kind of mistake occurred. What I want to discuss and address is uh, some features that should be changed for the benefit of the players. In one of my videos I already mentioned one and that's the pull option whenever you are trying to pull some characters. It's always if I go here on heroic or wherever it there, there should be an option if you have a lot of covers, uh, a lot of tokens, that you can instantly pull five or ten a multi multiple pull option. This is a desperate need in the game. So please help me by sharing this video and making a noise so that Marvel Puzzle Quest MD3 will have some thoughts about that. Another change would be alliance options. I mean the alliance administration is really meager. This has to be changed. You only have 20 people in the alliance. This should be upgraded to 30 and then so something like a better opt yeah better options for alliance in in a whole just a better um, chat options for the game what else um yeah please make a improve uh, make an improvement on veterans who have been playing the game for a long time and are only receiving meager daily rewards I mean like now is, now is the heroic token but ISO wise we are only like receiving me currently like 500 or thousand that's not that's not a lot as well as the contribution of every alliance member is only a hundred ISO so if you have 20 people in your alliance and all of them have played during the game you received 2000 I so this is not enough as the game goes on and you get more and more characters you are in need of ISO I'm not asking the developers to gift us ISO for free but could the rewards just be adjusted to more ISO as well as for certain PvE events, if the current event is ISO 8 Brotherhood and the rewards ISO wise are too small. Just let me show you. I mean, you're getting like 404, 440 ISO. Again, this is a seven day event, so the rewards are doubled. But come on, 440 ISO for achieving 16,500 points is, that's a poor excuse. Whenever you are playing, you are looking forward to those tokens and the covers and the hero points, command points. But the most you need is ISO. It doesn't matter how many strong characters you have, how many covers for a character you have. If you ha don't have enough ISO to level this character it is worthless for you you cannot use it he stays on he or she stays on a low level so please consider an improvement on that marvel puzzle quest md3 i think i wouldn't be the only one thankful for changes character wise the issues i have encountered is two of the last featured characters daredevil and yondu 
are quite similar when it comes down to their yellow passive ability. I don't have Yondu as you can see. His ability heals him, but he has to be below a certain amount of health. On maximum it is 50%. And Daredevil who came after Yondu and what's her name? Um, Mockingbird. Mm, there he is. He, it's, his passive is almost the same, and there is already uh, there has already has already been a video about Matt Murdock on YouTube, in which a fellow Marvel Puzzle Quest player explained this passive and. Neither he nor I are really thinking that Matt Murdock as a 5 star is a great addition for the 5 star pool due to this passive being completely worthless whenever you are above 50% of health. Same is for Yondu. So the developers might take a change about those yellow passives. I mean, a 5 star character should be. It uh, should be in acid and be stronger than that this one is a disappointment well that's about the video today it was a long one I have covered some topics I wanted to discuss and mention thank you for staying with me thanks for watching the video please Leave a like or a dislike, leave a comment in the comment description, in the comment section, in the description. <laughs> Share this video, subscribe to my channel. I am looking forward to the next video. I thank you for all those views, for all those subscriptions so far. And see you in the next video. Have a great day. Keep on questing. Bye. Huh?